everyone welcome back to my channel so for today's video i'm going to be showing you guys my long awaited room tour so as you would have seen in my last video i actually transformed my room so i got new furniture and rearranged my whole room so i hope you guys like watching this video and if you do don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below and without further ado let's just get on with the video so this part of the video is in collaboration with the wonderful arista living i purchased my bed off their website a while ago and i'm actually in love with it one of the great things about their website is that you can actually create your own bed. You can create your bed with three easy steps. So you can choose from different headboards, different colours of the bed and different storages. So I went for this lovely grey headboard with the curved edges. Um, I thought this would add so much more to the room and make it stand out even more. I decided to go for a double bed. I used to have a single and I love how much more space I have. So I will include a screenshot of my bed that I received from Arisa Living on the page here so you can see all the details if you wanted to get one similar to mine. I also do have a discount code for you guys which is HEV50. I'll leave it on the screen so you can see like a visual so you know what it's called. Um, so if you put this on their website you can get yourself 50% off any bed which I think is incredible and such a great opportunity for you guys. Thank you so much Arisa Living for giving me this opportunity. Definitely go check out their website and see which beds they have on offer. They do also have an offer where you can buy a bed and you get a mattress half price which again I think is incredible um, so if you're looking to renovate your room or redesign your room just like me then definitely check out their website. show you guys the storage that I went for so obviously I said I went for the four drawers so I've got two here and then two more over the other side for the drawers over the other side I decided to put things that I don't necessarily use all the time just because it's harder to get to so in this one I keep most of my schoolwork so as you can see I've just got all my like notepads and textbooks and folders um, so it's very deep and can fit lots in which is great for finding things that you don't really want on show or things just like schoolwork and stuff like that so then in my second drawer i also have some summer clothes which is obviously not one i'm going to be wearing at the moment because the weather in england at the moment isn't that great and then also in my other drawers i have some filming equipment they're really roomy and great for if you needed extra storage in your bedroom because we love a storage queen so as you come in my room and um, if you want to come in <laughs> um this is my bed so i have it on the back wall i did used to have it when i first built it i'm um, facing this way um but i think it makes so much more room having it positioned this way and i can also have the nice view looking out into my window um, of my lovely street so this bedding is actually from next it's got like little pom-poms on each corners however i do want to get a new bedding like a plain white one just because i feel like that might go with more things and i can also layer it with different blankets and then I also do have my lovely sloth on my bed. He's been featured on my Instagram so many times. I got him from Audi, I'm pretty sure. So next I have at the end of my bed this lovely ladder. Um, so this is like some shelving that I actually got from Dunelm, I'm pretty sure. But I've had this for many years and I just love adding like little features onto it. So I've got this lovely plant from Ikea. Um, I feel like the Ikea plants just add so much more to our room. So if you want to get some like plants, just go to Ikea and honestly... Yeah, it'll just make you feel like you're in a jungle. So then I also do have at the top my Linted at Da Vinci perfume, which is my absolute favourite. I literally swear by this perfume and I just, I'm in love with the scent. Um, and then I just have like little extra things um, going on on the shelf, which are like some of my favourite things. So like my candle from the Heritage range and then my Instax mini camera. I feel like this is great to like show off different things and, and obviously you can switch it up depending on like what you want to have as your theme in your room. So next we have my bedside table which is actually one of my new furnitures which I've recently built as you would have seen in my room transformation video. Um, so on here I just keep like my essentials so obviously I've got my phone which is like my essential thing ever, um, my glasses, my airpods and then I also do have my Amazon Echo Dot. I'm not going to say the name just because if you're watching this video and you've got one at home probably set them all off so I'm not going to say a name but you all probably know a name. Um, and then again I do have another Ikea plant, I'm literally obsessed with plants. Um, as we go around my room you'll see I have a collection of many different plants and I need to come up with names. Got any name suggestions leave them in the comments down below. Um, and then I do have my touch lamp um, which is like just an essential light. If I ever need to like check my room, if there's like any dark strangers in my room then I can just tap this on. <laughs> as you do on a daily basis. 
And then I do actually have two drawers on my bedside table, which is great again for storage. So I did actually purchase some LEDs after seeing them so many times like on TikTok and Instagram and YouTube. I just thought I'd purchase some and test them out. So I did actually make a TikTok over like unboxing and setting them up. So I'll include that now. As you would have seen, they completely transform my room at night time and I just love having them on before I go to bed. So I actually do have them where you can control them by a voice or an app. So I thought I'd just try it out. I know I said I wasn't going to say a name, but to, I might just bleep it out, but to turn the lights on, I have to say the name. Alexa, turn the light on. Okay. <laughs> You can change many different things with the lighting, so you can either turn the brightness down, up, or change the colour. So, Alexa. I'm having trouble connecting to the internet. Take a look at the help section in your Alexa app. Our Wi-Fi is rubbish. Alexa, turn the light to blue. Okay. Okay, so next part of my room is my chest of drawers. Again, this is new and this is part of the Mam collection. I don't think I mentioned about my um, side table, but that again is Mam. Um, the Mam range in Ikea is actually gorgeous and I couldn't help myself but buy the chest of drawers. And the only thing I've actually put on here is my TV. Um, this is my JVC TV if you're wondering. <laughs> So it's got three drawers and in here I just mainly keep my clothes and um, most of my running things. So again, it's great for storage because you know I'm literally obsessed with storage. Next we have my desk. This again is from the Mam range in Ikea. Um, as you can tell, I'm obsessed with the Mam range. So this actually has some glass on the top and then it has a really big, like a massive drawer. In here I just keep a load of random things. I really do need to sort it out. But basically things like glasses cases and phone cases and things like that. Um, you will probably have a drawer like that where you just keep random things in. And then on top I usually have my things to do today to-do list. My god that is a mouthful. Um, and then also my MacBook where I do most of my work. And then I also have my iced coffee on here. Um, I'm usually always drinking some sort of drink. Either a water or an iced coffee. This cup is actually from Starbucks. And it is one of my new obsessions. Thank you so much Elspeth for getting me it. The next thing on my desk is my mirror. This is actually from Next. And I love how it lights up around the edges with the little ball. Great for doing my makeup. And it looks really nice on my desk as well. And then next to it I just keep my little room spray, um, which smells insanely gorgeous. So next I have my Alex drawers, which again are from Ikea. Um, as you can tell, I literally love Ikea. I've probably spend most of my money for my room in Ikea. Um, but these are the classic Alex drawers, which I basically keep all of my makeup in. And again, they have so many drawers. So this does actually have nine drawers, which is why it's called the nine Alex drawers. Um, and then I just keep my lovely number seven mirror on here, which is great for doing my makeup because of the very vibrant light. I did actually get this for Christmas so I think it was featured in my Christmas haul and then I just keep my two makeup brush holes one of them is for my eyeshadow brushes and then the other is just for my normal makeup brushes and then my last thing on here is my trinket tray which I just basically keep loads of necklaces and jewellery my room is my mirror this is from ikea again and i'm pretty sure it's called the nissidal mirror um i'm not sure how you pronounce it but i think it's like that so i decided to add my ivy on the top just to add like a bit more greenery because this room just needs even more greenery i really love my ivy and whenever i take outfit of the day pictures or any mirror selfies this just adds so much more to the photo and then I also decided to add this lovely plant here I don't know why I did that this plant isn't actually from Ikea shocker it's actually from Home Bargains 
uh, I just really wanted a quite a big plant to add to this side um, and I think this just adds so much more to the mirror and makes it so much more gorgeous. I also really like the size of this mirror and wanted like a full size one um, because I used to just have one on like my um, wardrobe. So then lastly we have my wardrobe which is right at the other side of my room and this actually at the moment does have some media mind maps on because I recently had my media test and I've just not had the time to take them off but it adds some more colour to the room and it does show how hard I work so. So my wardrobe isn't the most tidiest so I'm not going to show you inside of that. So everyone, that's it for this video. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. So I'm really pleased with how my room turned out and I'm literally in love with the outcome. If you want to know where any of the things in my room are from, then definitely comment down below and I'll be sure to reply to your comments. Just giving you some inspiration for your room and maybe you've found some things that you might want to put into your room. Remember to check out Arisa Living's website and use my discount code HEAD50 to get 50% off your bed. So I think that's all for this video. I will see you guys very soon for a brand new video. Bye! I decided to add some IV on the top just because... <laughs> I really love my IV and whenever you type... Type? I really love my Ivy. <laughs> so obviously in my wardrobe I keep it close. <laughs>